Los Angeles tonight. Missouri and UCLA. The Bruins on a big run, leading by 10, 11, 20 to go in the first half. Flashback to one of the great moments, really, in the history of college basketball. Go back to 1995, second round game. Top seed in UCLA, trailing under five seconds to go. And their great point guard, Tyus Edney, coast to coast, the layup at the buzzer. Game winner for the Bruins. And, of course, UCLA went on to win the national championship after that shot by Tyus Edney Bill, who is now a big part of this Bruins program. Tyus Edney, 18 years ago. Tyus Edney. One of the ultimate pretty boys, <laughs> Tyus Edney from Long Beach, California, was mired deep on the bench. Couldn't get in the game. Tyus Edney, Coach Wooden, in a meeting with Jim Herrick at breakfast one day, and Vince, he said, hey, you got a guy on the bench over there that's pretty darn good. You might want to give him a look. The rest is history, and the Missouri Tigers will never forget about it. That guy is a great champion. Sadly, that was the last championship for UCLA. 18 long years. 12, we've got a tie game at halftime. What a thing of beauty here tonight. College basketball, Friday night, Los Angeles. Let's go. The end of the new year, out with the old, in with the new. Let's play. And we've got Bill Walton back with us here on College Hoops. It's 47 47 at halftime. Now we'll go for the Land Rover halftime report. We'll go back to our college basketball studios with Chris Cotter. Start of the second half, seventh rank, Missouri 47, UCLA 47. Dave Fleming, Bill Walton with you. And Bill, the Ware brothers for the Bruins were outstanding in the first half. Remarkable because this is where most people thought that the Bruins would struggle tonight. But the Ware twins, David and Travis, identical twins. Perimeter jump shots, getting on the glass, moving the ball, exquisite passing. Their spacing, their teamwork, the timing, everything outstanding. The Bruins are going to need that throughout the rest of the night. On the other side for Missouri, Phil Pressey, a game of mastery, just absolutely tremendous in every aspect, 12 assists, but the leadership, the stability, the poise, the confidence, the competitive greatness, all the things, and that's why he is highlighting our Wendy's wooden watch from Pauley Pavilion, and Missouri on a run, Bill, he plays a starter for the Tigers at the deep the offense off the quick hands, off the fantastic level of physical fitness. Ross throwing it down one time. Keon Bell poking it away again, right up there defensively. Throwing it down, I guess. For a tiny guy. <laughs> As he's going to the basket. Uh, you're not allowed to grab the jersey. I don't think Adams did that. The question is whether he made a true play on the ball. Frank Hayes did not think so. There's some controversy at the end of what has been a fantastic game. Controversy. We love it. Makes for good television, that's for sure. Where's Hank Nichols, the Hall of Famer, when we need him? 88-88. UCLA ended up committing four fouls in a span of about six seconds. The next one would be free throws for the Tigers. Nobody has a timeout left. That arrow does favor UCLA. And you got to figure, Bill, the game, the night that Bill Pressey has had here in the final five seconds. Ball at four Missouri. They had this game, and they've given it away. Why is Bill Pressey taking it out of bounds when he's got to be the guy that gets it and sets somebody else up? Moriaki wide open, but the mishandled ball and trying to get your own shot off too many dribbles under pressure. Come back to haunt you every time. I do think as Bell, that shot would have counted had it gone. If it was pretty 18 assists, dual record, the all-time college record in a single game, 22, shared by three. It's not often you see nobody score this, uh, Basketball, though. you know, a minute and a half in. A minute in a half in. Yeah. I could pronunciate. This game so special was the style. was the execution. Hit no one shot. Quick hitting attack. Now it's grinding. I think it's interesting that Bill Walton's doing play, or, uh, yeah, color. He's not everybody's cup of tea, and neither is Will Alternative via Spin Sports. Thrill, pill, no frills, whatever you would like to call it. I'm not trying to be everybody's cup of tea either. You do keep it interesting, though. Has come to life to electric tonight. Did somebody score? Here's five bucks. Let's go buy a basket. There we go.
Shot clock still at 12. The ability of Muhammad to stroke down that shot, but Brown right back in it. What you love about Shabazz Muhammad is that when the lights come on, he comes up. He's been the key man in overtime. Shot clock at five. Drew, Travis Ware, good! Brooks, a little bit of pressure. Final ten seconds. Pressy, long three, no good. Rebound, Bowers has it. Bowers has to heave it up. Comes up short. 